so hello friends i am neeraj and i hope you are doing great so that's so good so today we are going to see something very important and very crucial for a greater ui so we are talking about obviously we are talking about images so we will see to how we can embed images in our uh, in our application to in order to make it uh, more elegant and more feature rich because right now our, our our application is having the heading and we are having three buttons so we will use it this for navigation purpose at this stage of time and uh, what i think is we can have a featured image about our maybe our we are having a we are building this application for a maybe a product catalog store or or something or whatever so we can have a one featured image here so in this session so we are going to see how we can display a, a beautiful image in order to make our uh, ui look greater right so and uh, for the sake of uh, Uh, saving the time so we i have already created this images folder and in this directory this images directory i have uh, placed a sample image for demonstration purpose so let us uh, go with uh, our modify our home component to incorporate to embed the image right so we will need to use uh, another component from react native so we will need to import image from react native and uh, so that we can use it and also we will need to do some little change here because in react js and react native the return statement can only return one jsx element so that is why we embedded we wrapped all this view inside this empty jsx right and now we will start with a view and uh, this view we will call the image component and it takes on source so we will need to define the source equals and the self closing tag okay so here we have couple of options so either we can uh, embed image from the file system or we can import we can embed the image from the uh, network i mean remote remote image as, as well so let us try to go with the simplest one so for in order to uh, embed the image from our file system we need to go with require and in this this is a function so we need to provide the path of the image in the file system so right now we are our file is in inside components directory so we need to go back one directory up and then we can find images directory and finally our this image image.jpg so image.jpg right let's save it and uh, we will need to we will also give some styling and we will provide some uh, height and width to it so style equals and we'll go with uh, first let, let us go with the inline css so width equals let's say 400 and uh, height equals again 400 so let's save it and now let us try to see yes so it looks fine so let us try let us try to reduce the height of this image up to 300 now i think it looks okay it looks good so our and also we can have some text also here text and uh, maybe we can say feature image and uh, we can borrow provide this style so that our content this heading should look appear should uh, something in bold so feature i mean may uh, anyway so we can de definitely so we can uh, create another class another another css style for it so that we can uh, style it or maybe here also we can also go with let us create a um,
feature or maybe call it heading and we will create a CSS class for this heading heading it text on, ob on object again I will copy paste it here and this time the font size should be let's go with 25 and we will text align equals uh, I think center should be fine let us see okay fine so now it looks okay maybe we can provide some margin bottom and let's go with uh, three let us see yes it looks better okay so anyway so we can uh, we can do so so definitely like either this is the inline image and similarly we can also embed we can also call our uh, image from remote property as well so for the time being let me comment it out and we will try with the image and we will provide source equals and uh, list uh, rest styling let me copy it let me borrow it from here and and here actually we need to provide an object so this object we need to provide the first uri and this uri uh, and then this uri we can provide a uh, any image whatever we wish to uh, uh, to borrow from so for example say uh, we go to this website and uh, go to courses so here let's may let let's say we need to borrow uh, borrow so this image so copy link address and from here we have to simply provide the not link address rather image address copy copy image address provide the image address and save it and let us see yes so it is i mean either way both of both of the way work should work fine so let me have it something like here so so that we can have both of the images so let me reduce the width because that was a larger image actually and here also let us have some network image and let me call it file system image let us save it okay so actually this uh, this is uh, the styling is, uh, looks a little odd here so that thing we can uh, definitely we can uh, go ahead and we can fix them at later stage of time as as we play so definitely we can we can play with that so i'll leave that up to you to make it uh, styling uh, better maybe reduce some 200 200 okay so now it looks better much better let me reload it yes it is it look it it, it looks better and let me increase it here from 200 to say 400 by 300 so that uh, this one so we have seen both of both of the ways to load the images one is the file system images images available in our file system and we have also seen how to import uh, how to embed the network images obviously yes so we can so we can uh, we have to we can go we can give some styling and uh, maybe we can use the flex and at uh, next since next session so we will create we will try to create a full fledged card with uh, maybe a thumbnail icon some uh, like a visiting card kind of thing so maybe a thumbnail icon 
some text some address and uh, some designation so we will try to do to do to complete that thing in in next session okay so till then so i think like uh, we have covered how we can uh, provide embed images and uh, we have learned so far and uh, if you feel any doubts so definitely do uh, check out the documentation here so you will we will have plenty of information and uh, there are lots of things with the images we can uh, we can do so just uh, do check out here and uh, if you have any question or any doubt so please do let me know and i'll try to answer them as soon as possible so till then take care and happy coding